Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Hi. All, ahora fine, porque fine. no hay cadena nacional están tops. Yes. Qué eh, barbaridad. Eh, eh. <laughs> All right. Ayer solo unos poquitos estuvieron en clase. Ellos tienen. No le hicieron el llamado ayer de la, para unirse a la cadena. Mándeme. No le hicieron el llamado ayer para unirse a la cadena. No, fíjate. Al no. presidente. Of course, but no. Así que los que estuvieron en clase ayer tienen un punto extra. Eh, that's great. I know. Excellent. <laughs> Y los que no tienen menos dos. Ah, right, especialmente bien. Elmer. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right. Very good. All right. Oh, my goodness. I only have... Oh, my God. No girls today? Ah, oh, no, Florcita. Hi, Florcita. I'm sorry. I didn't see you. <laughs> sorry, Blood. All right. So, Jose Rodriguez. ¿Por qué no estuvo en clase ayer? Williams again. Uh -huh, the same thing. Flor, Elmer. José Ramos, Diego, Magdiel, Francisco, Manuel, Arias, a Juan Arevalo, Daniel Méndez, and David Rivas. So I'm so glad you guys are with me today. All right, so let's start. So yesterday we finished with section two. So for the ones that were not in class, I'm sorry, but we already finished. <laughs> All right, the topic was not very difficult yesterday. It's already on the YouTube list. If you want to see it, it's already up there. All right. So guys, today we're going to begin with section three. Okay, so um, let's begin with that one. I'm going to begin today by showing you the video from the platform. Not the whole video. I just want to work on a little bit of pronunciation before we start actually talking about the grammar. Go over. All right, so. Uh, I'm going to share the presentation. No, no, I'm not going to share the presentation. I'm going to say, say I'm going to share the video from the platform, you probably saw it already. And if you haven't, you will see it with me right now. We're not gonna watch everything. I just wanna show you this small part of the video here. Okay, just let me give me a second here. Hey, where's Noemi? Did I not know me? Huh? All right, so I'm gonna start sharing the computer sound so you guys can listen to it. All right, and then we're just going to work on it for a little bit. Listen and practice. Notice the intonation in questions of choice. Would you rather take broadcasting or economics? Would you rather study fashion or hospitality? Would you prefer to play the guitar or the violin? Do you prefer to study in the day or at night? All right. So if you notice, and this is not new for you, if you notice in English, we do like, we work a lot with the intonation, something that we really don't do in Spanish. We should, but we don't, all right? And as I said before, like to like most of my students in Spanish, we don't ask proper questions. I ask, Williams, no quiere comer? No, I'm already giving the answer on the question, all right? So the questions in Spanish, they don't really sound like questions. They should, but we don't do that, right? In this case, we're talking about questions of choice. So they are questions, okay? Why am I introducing the topic this way today? Because this is what we're going to study. The grammar that you see on this sentence or on these questions is the grammar that we're gonna go on uh, with like studying in a few minutes. But I, it's also very important to work on pronunciation. In this case, more than intonation. So here, if you notice the uh, lady speaking said, would you rather take broadcasting or economics? And then you like kind of go up and then you go down because it's a question of choice. You're giving two choices, all right? Or I said, would you rather study fashion or hospitality? And it goes down. Would you prefer to play the guitar or the violin? So guitar goes up, violin goes down. Do you prefer to study in the day or at night? So the uh, intonation in questions of choice, it's mandatory, all right? You have to make it sound properly, all right? So it's not the same as saying, would you rather take, or would you rather play the guitar or the violin? Uh, that's flat. You cannot be flat in life. You need to put like a little spicy here things, all right? 
So you say, would you, would you prefer to play the guitar or the violin? All right, so Eric says, oh, the guitar, or Jose says, oh, the violin. All right, so you, I'm giving you a choice. So the choice needs to be sounded out. I mean, it needs to be heard, all right? It's not like, I don't care. If I'm asking you, it's because I'm interested, all right? So I need to put emphasis and the right intonation when I'm asking, especially when I'm giving you a choice. Do you understand that? Yes. Yes, very yes. good. Let's see. Um, Jose Rodriguez, can you read the first one, please? Would you rather, and uh, try to do the, the right intonation of the question. Okay. <clears throat> Would you rather take broadcasting or economics? Or economics, all right, very good. Eric, can you do the other one? Would you rather study? Okay. Would you rather study fashion? or hospitality. Very good, all right, yeah, you're interested, right? Very good, Florcita. Next one, would you prefer? Okay, would you prefer to play the guitar or the violin? The violin. Or the violin. Oh, the violin, okay. very good, Florcita. Thank you, that's okay. Let's see, Elmer, my friend, can you read the number four, the last one? Do you prefer to study in the days or night? Or at night, all right? Do you prefer to study in the day or at night? Now, Williams, um, do you, let's see, do you prefer to study in the day or at night, Williams? At night. At night, with yeah. me, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Online classes, very good. Uh, let's see, Francisco, would you rather study science or social studies? Francisco? I'd rather study. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Go ahead, Francisco. Okay. okay. I'd rather to study science. Science, very good. Jose Ramos, would you prefer to play basketball or soccer? I, I prefer to play soccer. I knew it. Hi, Ellie. My goodness, Ellie. You said hello. Welcome, Hi. Anna. Very good. All right, Ellie. También me traicionó con la cadena ayer. Qué barbaridad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's okay. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, would you rather? Ah, uh, let's see. Ellie, would you rather take um, cooking class or dancing class? Uh, I prefer dancing class. Excellent. Very good. <laughs> Juan Arevalo, would you prefer to um, speak English or to speak Japanese? Um, I prefer to speak English. Excellent. That's a very good answer. All right. Very good. Let's see. Um, Eric Abarca, do you prefer to go to the beach or go camping? Um, I prefer go to camping. Ah, very good. All right. Very nice. Okay. So uh, if you notice, this, that's why I told you I just wanted to go over this because it's on the platform and I needed to learn, like for you to practice your pronunciation, especially in your intonation of questions of choice. Remember that when you're given a choice, the first one, the first choice, you go up and the, the second choice, you go down. All right. That's pretty much what it's talking about. Now I want to go on with the topic. I think it is 3.3 .3 on the platform. All right. That we're talking exactly about would rather or would prefer. Okay. Uh, I'm going to show you. Just give me a second here. I just want to, I don't want to show you the whole video because you can see that, but I want to go over something here. Just give me a second. Okay, there you go. I found it. Very good. Okay, so as I said, we're talking about 3.3, .3, would rather, would prefer. It's already in your platform anyhow. 
I'm not gonna show you the whole video. I just want you to pay attention to this. All right, can you guys see? Can you see? Yeah. Yes. All right, yes. very good. Yes. Okay, yes. so we have would rather and would prefer. Uh, Williams, can you read the green letters, please? Would rather? Yeah, would rather takes the base of form of the verb. Would prefer usually takes an infinity. Both are followed by not in the negative. All right, both are followed by not in the negative, right? So it says, thank you, Williams. Would rather takes the base form. That means that the verb that you're going to be using has nothing else but the base. I mean, nothing else but the verb, okay? So for example, I said, I rather take media classes so i have i rather or i would rather and then immediately after that i have take which is the verb all right the base form okay so i rather take media a media class that one with would rather now would prefer usually pay attention to this usually takes an infinitive so that means that sometimes it's not going to take an infinitive. It's going to take something else, okay? But right now, we're studying infinitive. So would prefer is a little bit different than would rather. Would prefer usually takes an infinitive. Infinitive means to plus the verb. So if you notice here, it says I would, uh, I would prefer to study film. Right, I would to go to the beach. I would prefer to take dancing classes. I would prefer to um, take classes at night, okay? So the difference between would rather and would prefer is the verb that follows, not the meaning. The meaning is the same. Which one do I have to use, Jessica? Whatever you want. You're saying exactly the same thing. How to use it is a different issue here. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Guys, you understand? Only Eric says yes. And the rest? Como ni yes, los I understand. Veo, no sé yes, yes, yes. Yeah. All right, very good. Thank you. Clear, clear. <laughs> All right, okay. So this is the idea. All right, Daniel Mendez, can you read, would you rather take a media class? Would you rather take a media class or a health class? Uh, Daniel, can you give a little bit more like of intonation when you ask that question? Would you rather take a media class or a health class? Ah, that's better, Daniel. Thank you so much. Porque si es la primera, es como que no le intereso. All right, solo me lo pregunta okay. porque whatever, right? Okay, so in that case, the intonation is very important. Would you rather take a media class or a health class? All right. So what is the answer? Juan Arevalo, can you read the uh, first one? The first answer. I'd? I'd rather take a media class. I'd rather take a media class. Very good. Lisette, can you read the second one? Thank you, Juan. Uh, yes, work. teacher. Would you prefer to study, still study or broadcast? Uh, Lisette, I'm sorry, the second answer from the first one, I'd rather uh, not take. Uh -huh. Okay. I'd rather take a medium class. Okay, all right. And the second one, it says, I thank you. I'd rather not take either. Ellie, can you read the last one? I'd rather take? I'd rather take another course. Another course than study media of, uh, or, or health. health. All right. I'd rather take another course than study media or health. If you notice, we're using would rather. All right. Now, you remember that we, when we speak English like fast, all right, we make contractions. So instead of saying on the answer, instead of saying I would rather take a media class, you say I'd rather. I'd rather take a media class. I'd rather not take either. I'd rather another course than study media or health. What I want you to pay attention on is that right after rather, we have the verb, all right, with nothing, only the base form of the verb, okay? Take or not take in that case. Be any verb, not only take, all right? These are only the examples. So you can use whatever verb, okay? Now, let's see. Um, 
Anna, can you read the second exam, the second question? Would you prefer? Would you prefer to study film study studies Studies? or broadcasting? All right, very good. Uh, David Rivas, can you answer like both? Can you say the both answers that we have there, please? Okay. I prefer to study film. Mm -hmm. And I prefer not to study to study either. All right, very good. If you notice, if you want to say no to something, just like rather or prefer, you write or you add not like right after that. I would rather not take or I prefer not to study, all right? But you need to remember, would rather goes with the, ver the base form and would prefer goes with infinite. That's cool here, okay? Do you guys understand? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. All right. Very good. Okay. So I'm going to stop sharing this one and we're going to go on to the other presentation I have here. Just let me get it here. Okay. So can you see? Yes. Now, would rather, uh, would prefer or would rather they express preference. Okay. So remember that you're giving me two choices. Okay. So I'm expressing preference. Which one do I prefer? I prefer to study at night. I prefer, or I would rather to take dancing classes, okay? I would prefer, you make the contraction and the pronunciation is I'd prefer. I would rather or I'd rather, all right? That's when we speak fast, okay? But both of them mean the same thing, all right? They uh, express preference. Okay, let's go on here. If you have questions, let me know. Okay, this is what I want you to pay attention to. Expressing preferences using I would prefer or I would rather. Listen to this one. The first square, it says general preference. General, in general, all right? You can say I prefer to go or you say, I prefer going. ¿Se acuerda que anteriormente decía, usualmente usua, usamos el infinitivo? Porque la otra parte del no siempre usamos el gerundio o el ing. Pero ahorita lo que nos vamos a concentrar es en el eh, infinitivo. All right? Les presento esto porque si usted lo encuentra va a decir, ah, no, pero ¿y entonces? All right? Cuando hablamos de general preferences, usted tiene two choices. O lo ocupa con infinitivo, como estamos aprendiéndolo ahorita, o lo ocupa con gerundio, con ing, y los dos son válidos, ¿ok? Pero es general preference. For example, sí. yes, uh, uh, yes. Perdón, este, y, pero cuando usamos gerundio no vamos a utilizar el tú. No, no, ya no. Solo I prefer going. Exactamente, I prefer studying. With just okay. a, ah, all right. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. Teacher. I prefer. Uh -huh. So you say, you say, I prefer studying at night, or I prefer to study. Ahora, cuando aquí lo han dividido, lo han dividido así. Cuando es una preferencia en general, all right. No es muy particular o no es muy específica. If you notice the example, it says, I never take the bus. I prefer to walk, or I prefer walking. All right. No estoy siendo bien específico en algo. Solo digo yo prefiero caminar. All right? Now, si tenemos particular preferences, entonces I'm only going to use infinitive. I prefer to go. It's late. I prefer to turn back. All right? So that's like a very specific or particular preference. Well, that's you need to use infinitive. Ahora, en la plataforma y los ejercicios, estamos ocupando infinitivo. Les presento esto, como ya dije, porque de repente lo van a ver y pueden decir, bueno, y no era así, pues, pues sí, también. All right, pero en la plataforma, en los ejercicios es infinitive, okay? Now, preferences. So everything here is preferences. I would rather plus infinitive sin el tú. Quiere decir que es un very infinitive, que es un base form. I never take the bus, I rather walk, all right? It's late, I'd rather return back. Ok, so ahí como veíamos en la plataforma igual, usamos el rather sin nada, solo el verbo, nada más. Only con el prefer usamos el infinitive 
or in todo caso el gerund. Yes. Yes, guys. Hello, hello. Okay. Yes. 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 Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Expressing preferences, I would prefer, would rather. Jose, eh, Ramos, can you? No, no, no. Jose, ¿dónde está el Josecito? Where are you? Se me escondió. Jose. No lo encuentro. Jose Ramos. No, the other one. Ah, José Rodríguez, no me acuerdo del apellido. José, <laughs> José Rodríguez, can you read, please? Expressing preferences, I would prefer, would rather. Continue at, uh, at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't say money. I prefer to spend, to spend it. Excellent. I prefer to spend it. Or? I prefer uh, spending. It. All right. Spending it. Correct. Excellent. Very good. That's a general preference for number two, Jose. I don't want to go out tonight. I prefer to stay in. To stay in. Uh huh. Stay in. That's a particular. Excellent. That's a particular preference. All right. So it's very specific. So in that case, it's only infinitive. All right. Very good. Manuel, can you read the uh, what follows, please? I don't want to go out tonight. I prefer to stay in. To stay in. All right. Okay. Continue with the other one, Manuel. Structure. Uh, a structure. Well, prefer has two plus infinity. Uh huh. Uh, a structure. Well, rather has infinity without two. two. All right. Siempre sigue siendo infinitivo. Lo que pasa que es sin el tú. All right. But if you notice, it's the same thing. All right. I prefer to live now. I rather live now. All right. Ahora, lo que usted no puede hacer es esto. I rather to live now. Me va a dar algo. Okay. So don't say that. Okay. El to, el infinitive, lo ocupa con el prefer, no con el rather. No vaya a andar inventando. All right. So I prefer to go. I pre, I rather. O es una o es la otra, pero no me haga una tutti frutti porque that's not true. That's not possible. Yes. Okay. Teacher, repeat yes. uh, this, please. Uh, yes. With with infinity, uh -huh. is two. Is with two. Yes, and only with prefer. Uh huh. Okay. If you use uh, rather, Anna, you don't use infinitive. I mean, you don't uh, use two. Okay. Okay. Look, okay. you cannot do Anita is to say I rather to live now. No, eso no. Okay. Si usted okay. dice así, nunca diga que yo fui maestra suya. No me digas. <laughs> my dear teacher. Yes, my dear student. No, no, mentira. No. <laughs> Ajá, el mercito. With rather, Ajá. only is infinity without two. That's right. No, no en gerundio. No, no, tampoco. Never, I, never. Es el peor todavía. Okay. All right. No puede decir right, I'd rather right. living now. Ay, no, Dios. Ajá. Nunca lo conocí, Elmer. Nunca nos hemos conocido. No es ah, cierto. ¿Por qué no ha querido? All right. Okay. All right. Teacher. Hola. Eh, es infinitivo. Cuando usted me dice, ¿es infinitivo o no, uh -huh. o no es infinitivo? R eh, with rather, ¿es infinitivo lo único es que es sin el tú. Exacto. En, 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 en una clase de gramática pura le dijeran Ajá. que es, se llama bare infinitive. El bare infinitive es el infinitivo sin el tú. Es un infinitivo desnudo, va, eso es lo que quiere decir, bare infinitive, que solo va el verbo. Could you spell for me, me, this? Bare infinitive. Dear. Ajá, bear. dear. Be Ajá. Bear. Bare, b a r e, ah, bare infinitive. Ah, bear, bear infinitive. Ok, uh -huh. thank you. Pero en, la, en, la, en lo común, digamos, decimos base uh -huh. form of the verb para que usted no se vaya a confundir. Ajá, ¿verdad? sí, Pero al es final, que cuando. Siempre, es, uh -huh. Para mí el infinitivo uh -huh. siempre lleva, lleva el siempre tú. Siempre lleva el pues, tú. O uh -huh. sea, ajá, porque obviamente solo he estudiado el básico. ¿verdad? That's right. Pero... <ríe> <ríe> Ay, igual para no, pues, sí. <ríe> <ríe> Entonces, eh. Sí hay otras clases de infinitivo, como usted me está diciendo, el ver infinitivo. El ver infinitivo, este exacto. Uh -huh. Ok. Uh -huh. Thank you, teacher. Very good. Lo que uno de, no, tenemos que aprender a distinguir. Cuando el verbo no lleva ninguna conjugación, está siendo usado en su forma infinitiva, infinitive, all right? Que no está siendo conjugado. 
Ahora, aún hay gente que se pregunta, bueno, pero si no está siendo conjugado, ¿por qué no le pongo el tú? ¿Verdad? Porque conocemos el infinitivo como el tú más el verbo. Por eso, porque se llama así the es. infinitive, ¿verdad? Ajá, que no es. le pongo el tú, pero ahí va, escondidito. ¿Ya? Ok. All right? Ahora, lo que necesito que les quede claro es que con el rather no va a llevar el tú. Ese no lo va a poner. Y menos gerundio, ese peor. Sí, Usted como no... que es más rígido, ¿vea? Si lo vemos, sí. si lo vemos desde... desde... Un punto lógico es más rígido, solo acepta solo, exacto. el infinitivo sin el tú, sin el nada tú. más. Exacto. En cambio, el otro es más el infinitivo con el tú. Ajá, es All más right. flexible. Very good, excellent, el mercito. Did you guys understand? Yes? Yeah. Yes, yeah, 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 thank you. Very good. All right, very good. Yes. Okay, expressing preferences. Do, 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 do. Eso no lo vamos a ver ahorita. Igual se las puedo mandar, you... solo que... Sí, please. Solo que no se vayan a confundir porque aquí hay... lo están usando en pasado. Eso no lo hemos visto todavía. Se las voy a mandar, pero no me dice, sí, que eso no lo vimos. No nos toca verlo todavía. All right. Right. Ok. A ver, veamos este aquí. Uh, it says, I prefer to leave now, all right? So, necesito one volunteer. Una niña volunteer. Ah, mi teacher, very good. ¿Quién dijo mi teacher? Mi Magdiel. Hi, Magdielcito. All right, very good. So, I prefer to leave now, Magdiel. Change it or switch it. Instead of saying prefer, can you use rather, would rather? Uh, I would rather leave now excellent i would rather leave now all right and nice very good all right and number two i prefer your mother to come another day ellie larin with Hola. would rather cambieme esa oración con would rather i i'd rather your mother come another day okay. very good all right very good and uh, let's see um Man, uh, Daniel Méndez, the last one. I prefer your mother to have come another... Ah, no, esa es muy complicada. No olvídelo, porque esa no la hemos visto. <laughs> It's okay, don't worry about it. No es que no la pueda hacer, solo que no voy a confundir. All right. Questions de lo que se ha visto? No, no questions. No se me duerma, no, no. se me duerma, Ericito. Qué barbaridad, no, Ericito. Tengo una pregunta. Ajá. <laughs> uh -huh. Hey, William. I yes. have a question, sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. <laughs> That's okay. Okay. Uh, how do I decide if I use uh, rather or mm -hmm. prefer? It's up to you. Okay. It's really up to you. You're saying exactly the same thing. All right. You're expressing a preference and you can do it using rather or prefer. Mm. I cannot tell you the one Doesn't is matter. more, no. I cannot say the one is more polite than the other one. I cannot really say the one is more serious than the other one. It's the same thing. It's really up to you, whichever one you want to use, as long as you use it properly. Okay. And the most common one? Yes. I would rather, I'd, I'd prefer to go. A native is I think prefer. One? I, 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 yeah, I think prefer, I we, use it, we use it more than rather. Like at, like the, at the very beginning, like at the very beginner levels, not many people know the word rather, so they use prefer. I prefer coffee, for example. They don't say I'd rather coffee than the other one, right? So that one, rather we use it more like in these kind of levels, but it's really like, maybe prefer we use it most. All right, Francisco, you have a question, no? Oh, no, it's clear. All right, very good. Okay, so what I want you to do now is I want you to go to your rooms, all right, to your breakout rooms, to your groups, and I want you to make sentences, all right? What I want you, for example, if I'm working with Diego, all right, um, I want Diego to ask me a question, all right, of preference. I, he's going to say, Jessica, would you prefer, and then he's going to ask me the question, all right, and I'm, I'm going to give a long answer. What I'm saying is, I'll say, depending what he said, I'm going to say, I'd rather to stay home. 
or I I rather uh, I rather do I don't know and then you continue all right with whatever answer you have to give me yeah so I'm gonna make three questions for example if I'm working with Diego I'm gonna make three questions and Diego answers them all right with either rather or prefer and then Diego is gonna ask me three questions and I would answer with rather or prefer you understand what we're going to do yeah. yes all right so don't get confused yes. because it's easy to get confused yes when, when you uh, when you say I rather not take either is uh, when I I don't have that that's I don't like any uh -huh. Uh -huh. when I don't like any all right no me ni me estés hablando de esa vaina like all like right that. yes something like that okay okay all right. thank the, you teacher the choices that you're giving me I don't like them all okay. right mm -hmm. All right, so we're going to go right now. Okay. Hi, Flor.
Okay. Uh, okay, ask me to. Okay, would you prefer? Would you prefer to drive a car or motorcycle? A truck. <laughs> Our truck. truck. <laughs> Uh, I prefer to drive a truck. Oh a my car. goodness! <laughs> yes, the trucks are comfortable. Are they? Yes, yes, are comfortable. And everybody said that truck is coming. Go away. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> yeah, it's very convenient. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right, that's good. All and right. you, teacher? What I rather, or I prefer to drive a car. A car? <laughs> a motorcycle? Called, no, no. <laughs> I'm scared of motorcycles. Really? <laughs> yeah, very, very scared. And the bike? The bicycle? No, I like bicycles, but motorcycles, I feel I'm going to die if I ride one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm really scared of those. <laughs> Daniel, do you do you ride a motorcycle? No. Oh, I, do. I, I can. I can ride yeah. motorcycles. I All only right. know how to, to drive cars and truck. And... All right. Okay, interesting. All right, very good. Just give me a second. I'm going to go check in another, in a couple of more groups and then we're coming back, okay? Okay. okay. El problema es la... What's the problem? Uh, Elmer, I talk uh, about please, you, teacher. Speak me in English. I don't understand in Spanish. Oh, yes. my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> very good. I'm talking I... about you, teacher. Why are you talking about me? He's a good a teacher, good, excellent good teacher. teacher. Yeah, whatever. I like the, the class. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, it's, it's true. <laughs> I, I love you. <laughs> whatever, that's not true. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes, teacher. What, what do you prefer? Uh -huh, tell me. <laughs> Would you... Pereme, pereme. Pereme, pereme. Would you rather you say take... That? Wait, wait. <laughs> Would you rather? Would you rather take a taxi or bus, teacher? A taxi. <laughs> would you I hate rather buses. take? Uh -huh. Would you rather uh, learn at night or in the morning? Mm, I actually don't mind. I can study at night mind. or or in the morning. It's okay. Poco a poco van a ir más caliente las preguntas. <laughs> <laughs> would you rather <laughs> would you rather drink tequila or whiskey? I rather not drink any. <laughs> I, I don't like together. it. <laughs> <laughs> bueno, otra cali caliente. Mejor me voy. Ajá, <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, what's the other one? <laughs> would you prefer to go to disco or uh, to dinner? I prefer to go to dinner. Uh, okay. Uh, otra caliente, no. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no. I'm scared. All right. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness, thank you, you're terrible. Thank you, I, 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 pra I practice the English, the classic. All right, very English good. Class. Yeah. <laughs> All right, very good. Ah, el mercito, you're terrible. Y José se fue. Juan José. David, perdón. David. No, está. No, no David. Ahí estoy. Ni sabe con quién está grabando. Todo el tiempo me dijo José. Oh, my goodness, David. He seems okay. a little crazy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. All right. All right, let's see. Um, I need, let me, let me see, let me see. All right, Eric Abarca, ask me one of your questions. 
Ericito, your microphone is off. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's okay. It okay. happens. Uh -huh. my, my question. Uh -huh. But ask me, okay? okay. Think about me. Uh -huh. <clears throat> okay, Jesse. Mm -hmm. Would you prefer to listen rock or romantic music? Oh my goodness. Um, I prefer to listen to romantic I need a reason. music. <laughs> you need a reason. Oh my goodness. Um, Cumbias. No, I don't know. I don't like rock. Banda. But if you if I'm you're asking me which one I prefer, I prefer <laughs> okay. romantic. You prefer. But okay. I'm I don't mind rock. It's okay. Thank you, Eric. Very good. Aha, uh -huh. Diego, <laughs> ask me another one, Diego. Uh would you rather eat pizza or hamburger? <gasps> oh my. Oh. I rather eat pupusas. <laughs> <laughs> I rather eat um hamburger. Hamburger. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Williams. Uh -huh. William, porque está tan serio. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. okay. Ask me a question, Williams. Uh -huh. Okay. Would you prefer to drink coffee? Or coffee. <laughs> no, or tea. <laughs> I prefer... You have to, an option, yeah. Yeah, I don't like coffee, so I prefer to drink... What? Tea. I don't like coffee. I hate coffee. You're broke. No! <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't drink coffee. No, teacher. No. I swear, you said, I don't drink coffee. I hate it. <laughs> It's delicious, that coffee. Mm, I, you know what? I love the smell. It's very delicious, but I don't like the taste. <laughs> All right. Okay. Thank you, Williams. Very good. Jose Rodriguez, uh -huh, ask me a question. Okay, teacher. Would you prefer to room or swimming? Ah, no, hijo. Swim, no, me muero. I prefer, <laughs> I prefer to run. Okay. Yeah. Very good. All right. Elmer Argueta. I know. Ceci, preguntale a Elmer. Ajá. Mejor no, teacher. Okay. Next. Francisco. <laughs> Come on, Elmer. Ask me the question. Ajá. Se fue. <laughs> okay, Francisco. Ajá, Elmer. Hi, teacher. Ajá. Ask me the question. No, no. <laughs> Okay, Francisco, you asked me the question, okay? I think you broke his heart. He has no heart. Really? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All right. Robot. I don't know. Let's see. Uh -huh. Francisco, you asked me the question. Francisco, not there. Hmm. All right. Uh, Cecilia, you asked me the question. No. Oh my goodness. Magdiel, can you okay? There you go. Francisco, can you ask me the question? Okay. Okay. Would you rather stay in home or go out? Ay, ay, ay. I rather <clears throat> right now I stay home. But <laughs> yeah, because but it, because of the option. quarantine, <laughs> yes. But I <laughs> rather yeah, I rather go out. I rather go out. Very good. Aha, uh -huh, Cecilia Mendez. Uh, would you prefer to cook or eat? <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> All right, very good. Cook, cook ne never in the life. No, I always you cook. Prefer <laughs> ask for eating. Sorry, Eric. No, I don't. I mean, I don't mind cooking, but eh, it's okay. I have to do it. All right, let's see, Magdiel. What's your question? <laughs> Okay, teacher, my question for you is, would you rather eat Italian food or Chinese food? Wow, um, I love both, so it, either one, it's okay. I I like both. Okay, fine. All right, Anna, question, Anna. Okay, and would you rather watch comedies or horror movies? <gasps> comedies. 
Ok. Así <risa> si veo otra cosa, no duermo en años. Uy, no, Dios guarde. All right. <risa> Thank you, Anita. All right, José Ramos. Ok. okay. Uh, would you rather teach online or face to face? Oh, uh, that's a good question. Nice question. Yeah, I like both. They're, they're unique in both ways. I mean, in their own ways. So I like both, actually. Very good. All right, Eli. Hola. Uh -huh. So with the question, Edita. Um, would you rather... <laughs> you rather, would you rather uh, would you rather work in home or in the office mm. would you rather work at home or at the office hi i like both actually i enjoy Neither. both I think it's the same. I mean, if I have to work at home, I work at home. If I have to go work, I go work. So I, I like both. Very good. David, uh huh. Would uh, you prefer to speak English or Spanish? <laughs> Depends. Depends who I talk to. So, but I, okay. I like both. Yes, very good. All right, Manuel. Manuelito, apúrese que José Rodríguez me tiene con el tiempo así, ve. Ay, no mentira, José. All right, very good. Daniel Méndez, ajá. Ok, um, would you prefer to travel to United States mm -hmm. or Europe? Oh, I rather Europe. Yeah. All right. Very good. All right, Flor, Florcita. No, no, there, Lisette. Yes, teacher. Uh huh. What's your question, Lisette? Would you rather to use? No, sorry. Would you rather use Facebook or Instagram? I neither. I don't have Facebook and I don't have Instagram. <laughs> I don't know. I don't drink coffee. I don't have Facebook. I don't have Instagram. I don't know. No. All right, very good. Where do you live? <laughs> what do you mean? All right. Social media too, teacher. Huh? I don't have social media too, teacher. Yeah, there you go, Magdal. Very good. I only have WhatsApp. That's it. I don't need Facebook. Yeah. I don't need anything else. I like only too. <laughs> Very good, Magdal. We're best friends. All right. <laughs> Juan Arevalo, what about you? Um, would you prefer going to the mountain or the beach? I prefer... Oh both i like going to mountains and i like going to the beach okay yeah i like both all right very good thank you guys i know josecito is thinking it's 10 01 all right so yeah we need to go <laughs> <laughs> that's okay jose all right very good guys so the idea was for you to practice would rather and would prefer all right remember that when you actually like act, uh when you ask real questions the intonation is okay and then remember when to use with to plus the verb or without to and just the verb, okay? That would help you a little bit. I'm gonna send the presentation anyway. It's very long because it talks a lot about other things, but it's gonna help you, okay? So thank you so much for being with me tonight. I'll okay. see you thank tomorrow. You. Gracias a Dios. Have a nice day. Conferencia de prensa, all right? O cadena nacional or whatever, all right? Bye, guys. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. 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 B